Hey, guys, uh, everything OK? No. Someone stole a laptop. We can't sell it online and split the cash. I wish Jay would stop lying. I wish he'd just tell the truth. So what are you going to say? That we stole the laptop and we're selling it online. But your wish came true. <sighs> right. I'm not lying. I can't lie, and I need to lie. Well, I'm going to tell Maylee and Scott that I stole the laptop. Sasha isn't responsible for the laptop. I am. Jay! You what? Oh, great. So why didn't you tell on me? Don't worry. I'll get my revenge another day. You'll try. Enjoy those chores. Hi, Jody. I'm Ben, your counsellor. Nice to meet you. So, let's do this. First, we'll concentrate on the situations that trigger your anger. Then we can look at coping mechanisms to try and help us change the way you react. My mum wouldn't let me have a bath or wash my clothes unless the social worker was coming round. I mean, I was wearing the same tights and stuff for weeks. How did that make you feel? Why are you asking all these stupid questions? You deserved love and care. But she's still my mum! I'm not just going to stand here and let you talk bad about That's her! That's not what we're doing. What then? I'm going to end up hurting people. My mum knew that. That's why she dumped me. Your mum giving you up wasn't your fault. We can talk about this if you still want to. You're giving up on me just like my mum did. No. Liar! You're as bad as she is! See? That's the kind of person I am. Oops. There's a program I've been watching. It's the last one in the series. Don't want to miss it. Is there something else going on? It's Tyler. I haven't heard from him recently. Right. Let's the chores and come to the living room. We need to have a pop shot. And while you're at it, you might as well find them a moment on your way. <laughs> Did you really just say that? What? You're the laziest, most manipulative... People in it now. You know, selfish. Then you are nice after all. Am I? I started watching that series with my auntie Jean, but we never got to finish it together. That Tyler? Yeah. No. You know what? I'm going to tell him off. Eight days, Sasha, not a word. He needs to be told. He should probably fix this first. What do you think's on it? There's only one way to find out. Save Albert and Rod! Save Yeah. Save We've got to fight for this! Save this is for our future! Save Albert and Rod! Save Albert and Rod! What's this? Council are planning thing. It says they're going to cut down the trees and build offices. You can't build offices on Ogleton Wood. My hands are tied. The consultation period is over. It's all been agreed upon. Um, help me. Tell me what to do. Hargreaves! How many other woods in England have a Filipino duata? A site of cultural and spiritual significance. Do you know what? I think I can work with this. No guarantees, but we're definitely back in the fight. That's all we want. A chance to keep fighting. So much like your mother. Well, I never. What's wrong? It's a bin man. He's stolen Fred. You're right. I'm meeting with my new social worker today. Well, you've come to the right person. I speak fluent social worker. I'm afraid. Run! Uh, I can't lie. Of course you can. I spent most of my life lying to social workers. They totally fell for it. I told you it would work. Please, he's the only thing I've got. He's my chance to turn things round. 
I missed my meeting with my social worker. If Millie finds out, I'll get in trouble again. I've got an idea. Give me your phone. You need him more than I do. He helped me find my family here. Maybe he can help me find yours again. Yes, hello. I'm calling with regards to my client, Floss Guppy. Oh, one more thing, Katie. Quiet room, right now. Fun. Well, since you're wanting someone to spend some time with, why don't you show Sienna to her room? Give it a tour. Hi, school. You're so good at this, Sid. Great. Everyone gets a turn but me. I bet if the console went missing for a few hours, you'd be able to play it. I'll steal the console for you, and in return, you'll owe me a favour. Here you are. What do you want in return? Nothing much. Just money. From the office. The pocket money? Are you serious? If you don't help me, I'll frame you for stealing the console. Floss is trying to steal our money. What? It was Sienna. I was trying to stop her. She was twisting it. Sienna stole it and she's trying to put the blame on me. She's got a fake photo on her phone. She's blackmailing me. I have no idea what she's on about. Look, here's my last photo, taken this morning. You got anything to say for yourself? I want to leave Ashton Ridge. <laughs> what do you know? Found it. What? How? I deleted it. Got you. You're in the night rock festival, what do you bet? You should have seen the dead night thrashing. My ears still hurt. Oh, it's good practice for all the yelling that Maylie will do if she finds out that you went without her permission. No, my alibi is full through. He thinks I'm like my mum now. Maylie is never gonna find out. <laughs> oh no. Hey, Sasha. I knew it. Uh, do what? I know it was you. And you too, bad. You most thick of thieves. What are you going on about? I know you sent that photo. What photo? Look, I don't know anything about your photo. Why don't you tell me what you and Tony have been up to? Whoa! I'm going to call the number who sent the messages. Whoever it is must have a second phone, and when we hear it ring, then we'll know who's behind it. Nobody in this house has a second phone. Who would have a second phone? Here we go. Now you'll see. Hey, guys, what's up? Hugs. Got a bunch of junk for you to palm off on some poor sucker. I think I've caught feelings. But you're not showing a type to just deal with it. What, because I'm not some hipster? Jay, why are you dressed like that? Like what? I'm not dressed like anything. I know this isn't you. The music, the clothes. Why are you doing all this? I like you. Like, like me. Oh, yeah. I meant as friends. I find it hard to open up. You let people in and they let you down. This Jay though, the real Jay, any girl would be lucky to have him as a boyfriend. Hey! Say hello. Jane! Who's that? My cousin? Well, we've heard back from Children's Services about the potential new living arrangements for you. It's been successful. I get to live with Iona. Yeah. I'm getting married. <laughs> Will you be my bridesmaid? What do you mean, gonna be not hot Iona's? I don't know, actually. Well, the house might. I haven't been to any house. I need to find Scott. This is my job. My life. So we can all do it like a posh grub, OK? I don't want to leave. I'm not ready. I'm sorry. I don't know why I do that sometimes. Because growing up with nothing was hard. We miss you. I'm ready. Well, I think I am. And there's only one way to find out. Oi! Murphy! Do you know him? My mother. Children's Services have managed to get hold of your mum 
in Spain. I'm not staying. Sadly, you are. You can't tell me what to do. You're not my mum. Open the door. Let me go home. And I will. That's not an option. I'm not a baby. But you are a child. You should be looking after him all the time. You deserve somewhere better. Somewhere like this. What are you doing here? I'm a bit busy, so... Uh, I know we weren't friends, exactly, but... We've got different lives now, Ruby. We've nothing in common anymore. You should get back to Ashton Ridge. Ruby, I've got some good and some bad news. So Bex's aunt Hannah emailed back, but unfortunately, they're away at the moment. Away? Oh, I want my phone back. You'll get it when you learn to behave. I made lunch for Aunt Hannah. I mucked out the horses. You'll be out in the barn again if you don't stop answering back. I don't get why you're putting up with her. Because if I tell anyone, I don't know what Graham will do. And Hannah needs me. What am I supposed to do? You'll break her heart if you go. Beck? Ruby? Who on earth are you? I'm from Ashton Ridge. Who are you? This is all a misunderstanding. Families argue. You made your granddaughter sleep in a barn. If you walk out of here, Rebecca, you are never coming back. Goodbye, Graham. Sash. It's stunning. You really think so? Yeah. Do you know what it is? Uh, are they dancers? It's just them. It's you and me. And Tyler. Yeah. You just want to call him or something. I mean, you clearly don't care about all this. I mean, you forgot about it today. What are you having a guy before? Whoever did that must be seriously rich. Ashley Pallister. That's who did it. Pallister. Because people who are well off get more opportunities. And that's privilege. Yeah, I know, I know. You said, look, I wish you'd listen to me. No, do. What have you done? <laughs> so I swapped the names on the sculptures. What are you thinking? Rose chocolates for Candy Rose. Yeah. Bird, do you like. like it? Like, like, like. What? No. Of course not. Oi! Robbie, um, the electrician? He's really sweet. He asked me on a date. Oh. I'm really sorry, but Candy Rose is sick. She's had to go to bed. Oh, I... I'm sorry. I hope she's OK. Oh, yeah, she'll be fine. I'll look after her. Yeah, well, you know what not, mate? What? The reason Tyler left you. The reason your family's so messed up. The reason nobody in the DG likes you. Because you mess things up. You mess everything up. I hate you. Yeah, well, this friendship, me and you, it's over. The, the thing is... What's wrong with me? What? Bobby hasn't turned up. There must be something wrong with me. It's, it's Bird. I've done something terrible. I've lied to you. Ta-da! <laughs> About what we said. Yeah, it got a bit out of hand, didn't it? Sorry for saying, you know, you're a bit up yourself. <laughs> and I'm sorry for calling you stupid. Pallister's art gallery just phoned. We didn't do anything. They just wanted to know where Sasha was. I mean, she's meant to be there collecting a prize. What well, I won. What's up? Children's services have been in touch with some big news. 
they found your mom? All I know is one day she said she had to make a phone call. And then she left you in the shop. This is Jen. Hello, Floss. Do you regret leaving us? I regret that you've had a hard life. Could we talk about making these visits a regular thing? Um, I'm not here to rescue you, Floss. Maybe you should have just asked for my picture and saved yourself the train fare. I deserve a mum who has time for me. A mum who's interested in me, who wants to help me. A mum who loves me. But that's not you, is it? You've got to be kidding me. Yeah. So the total stands at £20,430. That equates to £6,810 each. Not bad for a day's work. Whoa, 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 slow down. I haven't even decided what to do with it yet. Someone's going to be out there looking for this. And it is our duty to try and return it to them. Right, Bird? So we're all in agreement. We have to go to the police. This is the fresh start me and Jade need. Just us. Together. They might have dealt us a bad hand, but... That doesn't mean we can't still win. What do we do now? Go after him. Bro, just listen. I can't explain now, but I've got us a plan. You don't sound like you, bro. I'll call you a better signal. Just don't do anything you're going to regret, yeah? So now what? Well, what I should have done in the first place. Hand the case in. Who are you? <laughs> I'm your... I'm a... I'm Dahya. And I'm a friend. Well, then you have to help me. I, I can't go back. Thing is, I've been offered a soda record deal. No locked doors. No staff with alarms on the belts. I could get used to this. Special restrictions. Locked doors. Do you think these come from secure? Maybe this book holds a clue. Calling all Death Night Flashes fans, stand by for an exclusive private from Drew, where he'll be performing some of the band Racist It. So what do you think? I really thought you understood me. With the album and the tour on the cards, I'm going to need someone around to help me with the things I'm not good at. What do you think? Why would you turn that down? Murphy? I can't risk him going off the rails again. Why were you insecure? You don't have to answer that. I tried to help a friend and it backfired. It was a mistake. <laughs> You're an idiot not to go. So don't worry about me. Thanks, Murphy. Hey, about before, in my room, going through my stuff really won't cool. Yeah, sorry, it won't happen again. You better not, cos next time, you'll see a side of me that you won't like. <laughs> sorry, guys, I couldn't do a big goodbye, but it's me. I wasn't gonna leave without saying anything. You guys, um, you've all made the Dee the most important, amazing time in my life. I'm Tasha Bellman, and I'm out. Everyone, this is Nathan. He's going to be doing some work experience for today. So be nice. And also, just so you know, he's my brother. Brother? He's Rota. Some people are on it twice, and others not at all. We can sort it later. The important thing is, Maylie's happy. You're in her good books. What? It's about being responsible, growing up. Like, this could be a good chance for you. I'll get you back on track, mate. All right? Get you a job, a decent flat. What is going on? <sighs> Maylee, I... Whatever this is, sort it out now. Maylee, this is all my fault. I made him take me in. No, don't lie for me. All right, this is on me. I quit. You can't go. Those kids in there depend on you. I've learned a lot about myself. And I'm going to use it to be a better care worker. <laughs> An even better care worker. You're going to be OK. 
Yeah. Mate came through with a spare room. And a job? I don't think care works for me. But I might take up some footy coaching. You need to deal with this, Sid. Sid, can you fix it? Talk to us. After Sid. Please, Sid. We you all just shut up? I can never get a moment's peace in this house. All I want to do is fly my drone, not deal with any of you. None of you understand. None of you. Just go away, please. The good news is, your shoulder's only dislocated. So the doctor just needs to pop it back into place. How are they going to do that? Don't worry, all right? The procedure's under general anaesthetic. Whoa. Where am I? This isn't a hospital. Salutations, Commander Sid. Whoa! What? Who are you? I'm a secure cyborg on board telecommunications transmitter. But you can call me Scott. We've got no time to lose. Are you ready to catch this lizard? You betcha! Gotcha! Yes! yes! Finally! Yes! It's time to get back to reality. I'm entering a competition called The Loudest Laugh. The deadline's this afternoon. I need to send a video of a routine, and if I win, to promote their favourite three acts to over 20,000 subscribers. That's amazing. You'll be famous. Hold on. Look at that comment. Is this black comedy? Or do we call it brown comedy? What? You're no fun right now. Today's been rotten. And you laugh like nothing's happened. What are you going on about? How can you pretend everything's OK? Do you want to...? No, I don't care. Stop using my problems to make yourself feel better for being ignorant. You have the right to be angry, bird. But like, what happened to you was wrong. Taking it out on people that care about you? That isn't you. You need to find a platform to turn that anger into good. Racist comments have no place on my channel. It's not what people come for. They come for my comedy. And my uh, Hollywood good looks. Why are you laughing? For today to work, things must happen as and when they need to. No wasted motion. No one gets left behind. I think he's gone to his dad's. Probably. What did the police say? They're going to try and get someone to his dad's house in the next couple of hours, but... Do you think I should go? Kyle? I don't need you or my dad or anyone else. Back at Ashley Ridge, you've got people who want to help you. If you let them. Is everything all right? Kingsley's dead. Okay, Kingsley, but don't knock me in. You'll come out when you learn some respect. No, Kingsley! Kingsley! Why don't you come in for a chat? We can have a cuppa. I'm busy sorting stuff for the funeral. Let's just get through tomorrow, OK? I can't do this. I was supposed to see him as part of my therapy for closure or whatever. No, he's taken that away from me, too. You can't change your past, but your future, that's up to you. If you want closure, get closure. I think I might like girls. There. I don't care what anyone thinks. Why keep it a secret, then? I'm still figuring it out. I love you, Jodie Jackson. I always have, and I always will. I love you too. You're gonna be okay though. I'll be fine. Don't leave it so long before your next visit, eh? Oi, it's expensive flying halfway around the world, you know? 